Normally on ten meters, propagation follows the sun. Hence, in my last video, I had a pedestrian mobile contact into California, all the way across the Pacific. Today, it's a bit later, around 3:30 p.m., which means most of the sun will be that way. Hopefully, that will mean some contacts into maybe as far as Europe, or if not, parts of Asia. Sugar 57 Sugar, Sugar 57 Sugar. Uh, this is Victor Kilo 3 Yankee Echo. Uh, good morning to you, good morning to you. Uh, you are 5 and 7, 5 by 7, over. Thanks for the, thanks for the 5 and 7, yeah, burn. We are uh, Italian station, can you, can you copy you? I got a very good location here, I can copy you. Five and four for the maximum. Name is Alexander. Alexander. Echo Mobile. Sugar five seven. Sugar. I'm running 200 watts. 200 watts. Maybe a little bit less. Into my spider beam. Spider beam antenna. That's five band version. I got a four active elements of this band. Ocean Mike Five Radio. Yeah, good, Peter. It's a good signal. You're five and seven, five and seven, and a good steady signal. Um, and I saw your latest video, by the way, uh, with the uh, the new antenna matcher. EBK three Y EBK four ABK. Yeah, uh, Peter. Uh, the name this way is Gary uh, Golf Alpha Romeo Romeo Yankee. Yeah, I got a uh, good signal. I've uh, been listening to you for a little while, and uh, you're coming in up here uh, uh, up onto the Aston Tablelands in far north Queensland, and uh, I've got you about five and three. And uh, we're only using 10 watts this way there, rather. Good one there, mate, and uh, we'll talk to you again sometime. Uh, VK3, uh, YE, uh, VK4, ABK. Yeah, right there, Pete. No, you're doing quite well. You're peaking 5 and 7. You're up to 5, 5 and 7. So what's uh, what's the antenna there, Pete? Over. Well, you're peaking 5 and 8. You're up to 5, 5 and 8, and, and the flex... The flex is pretty mean at giving five and eight, I can tell you. So it, it's radiating pretty well. Zemba, Papa, calling CQ10. AK VK3, Yankee Echo Mobile, VK6 MPJ. Very good afternoon to you. You're uh, about five and five, 55 with me. Operator name this way, Peter, Papa Echo, Tango, Echo, Romeo. And uh, we're located in the city of Bunbury on uh, on the, the south coast of uh, Western Australia. Said uh, five watts, you're certainly doing that, and the antenna's working really well, um, for sure. Um, without uh, any uh, any problems, I can hear you quite okay. Yeah, Roger, Roger, Peter, Victor Kilo Three Yankee Echo, VK Six Zulu. Charlie Victoria, name is send is gone. Charlie Oscar November. Yeah, surprisingly strong, uh, Peter, about a five nine into the city of Perth at the moment. I think you said you're a pedestrian mobile, so uh, I figure you're trailing a 
giant ad- <laughs> antenna on a trailer. Or maybe it's just the band conditions are in great shape at the moment. Uh, VK3 Yankee Echo, VK6 ZCV. CQ, CQ, CQ. CQ, CQ, CQ. The Echo uh, Victor Kilo 6 Delta Uniform. Yeah, VK3 Yankee Echo, VK6 DU. Name here is Lance. Lima Alpha November Charlie Echo. Name is Lance and I'm in Perth. And uh, surprised to hear you, uh, Peter. <laughs> Just thought I'd... Yeah, fantastic. All right, uh, I'm running 100 watts here and uh, a small Yagi on a tower. Beaming out to your way. Yeah, Victor Kilo 3. Yankee Echo, VK3, Yankee Echo Mobile. Yankee Echo Mobile, my goodness. Uh, really, 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 uh, interesting to copy you. I think you said you mobile, Victor Kilo 3, Yankee Echo Mobile. Very good day to you from Cape Town, South Africa. My call, Zulu Sierra, number one. And my name is Peter. Uh, you're about a 4x4 four four to 4x5. Four about a 4x4 four four to 4x5. Four I wonder how you copy. Microphone back to you. Victor Kilo 3 Yankee Echo, and I think it says mobile from ZS1 Papa Zulu. Oh, that is, that is truly amazing. That's uh, truly amazing, uh, Peter. A very good day to you from uh, Cape Town, South Africa. My name also Peter. And all noted, you're walking along the beach, so uh, you mobile QRP. Not an easy copy. I've got the headphones on, but I heard everything you said. You're running 5 watts, 5 watts QRP. You're running an FD 817 and a half wave vertical in your backpack. I presume you're very close to the water or you're standing in the water. And uh, you said you're about 30 kilometers south of uh, Melville on your QDH. Well, what a, what a wonderful, uh, what a wonderful QSO. Absolutely amazing. I'm, I'm, I'm so surprised. I can, I can hear you on five watts. And I'm actually so surprised that you're giving me a 58 5 by 8 So that's a real good uh, a signal report, uh, Peter, which is the most uh, southwesterly point in Africa. So I can see the Indian Ocean and the Atlantic, but I do have a small mountain range in between myself and you. So I'm actually beaming just to the corner of the mountain range. Uh, Mike, any copy? Yeah, very difficult, uh, about a two by two. Uh, was a little bit loud earlier, but uh, you go ahead and pick up the other guy. Okay, give Peter a call and then we can get a signal report from him. He's probably stronger than me. No doubt. A VK3 Yankee Echo Mobile, you copy Zulu Sierra 1, Radio Japan Queen. Over, over. Yeah, QSL the 57, Peter. Uh, you're a 4x4, four four, a 4x4, four four, 44, Peter. Nice to work you uh, down on the beach there. The name is Mike, he makes go with the Hilo Echo, and I'm two kilometers away from Peter. And lovely working you, and you're in the log of Peter. I'll pass you back to uh, the other Peter, that is one Papa Zulu. Uh, you take it. 73, Peter. Okay. QSL, QSL. All right, uh, Peter, well, that's uh, fantastic. I'm looking at your QRZ.com page, and you've obviously got a lot of experience. Congratulations. Uh, that's uh, truly you've uh, made my day. What a, what a fantastic QSO. Peter, all the best to you, and uh, we'll definitely do it again sometime. Man. Well, it was a very successful afternoon of operating. Uh, all but two of them were within VK or ZL. Um, VK6 was the most number, Western Australia, which probably figures given that it's over the bay in that, that direction, so the water might have helped. Also, um, uh, VK4, uh, Northern Queensland, uh, came through quite well, and New Zealand. Um, as far as real DX goes, well, there were two contacts there, uh, in Europe earlier on, and also the contact into South Africa, which uh, was probably the best of the lot. Uh, really, really good contact with um, uh, Peter ZS1PZ. So, um, yeah, a lot of fun.
And as for the antenna, I've done a, people ask me, you know, what antennas are you using? Well, I've done a video on this antenna. Um, couldn't be simpler. Basically five meters of wire, a toroid, and a variable capacitor for the matching. And that gives you a half wavelength on 10 meters. But as the capacitor is variable, that's, um, you've got a bit of room to have it operating on other bands. Uh, including 11 meters, 12 meters, maybe even 15 meters. All the contacts I've made on it so far have been on 10 meters, so definitely uh, can vouch for its performance there. So, um, yeah, if you uh, make this antenna and have success on 10 meters, then let me know in the comments. Uh, the conditions are definitely great for 10 meters as we're approaching the peak of the solar cycle, so we should have a few years of conditions like this where you can have an ultralight set up like this and operate pedestrian mobile, um, even on SSB. Now, if you're interested in reading more about these simple portable antennas that give you great results, um, then check out my two books, Hand-Carried QRP Antennas and More Hand-Carried QRP Antennas. Uh, a lot of information about mainly very simple wire antennas, usually often supported by squid poles, uh, so that quite a cheap way of getting some good height and um, yeah especially with the good HF conditions coming up you'll get some great results from those so have a look on my, my website vk3y.com and check out my two ebooks on antennas and others on other amateur radio topics